Well, hello there, brothers and sisters of the Vodblades universe. You're watching Vodblades Addict again. Welcome back to the channel. And today, we're gonna watch the mastery. This time, from me and my Cheeto. As I told you in the video about the uh, gateway to uh, Japanese TDs, uh, I was playing a lot of Cheeto just to get XP for the new line of TDs, Japanese Hori line. So basically, uh, yeah, I was able to master it finally. Uh, and uh, as I told you there, this tank is great if you if you can use it, so use his DPM. Uh, the penetration values which are great and uh, mobility which is average. Uh, but still it's a medium tank. Um, I, I would say that mobility is comparable to, um, let's say, Type 58 or uh, T3485, so it's not that bad. So basically the only downside of this tank is its uh, armor, which is no one existent on this tank. So basically you have to uh, use your other great stuff like gun depression, penetration values uh, and DPM just to uh, try to get those uh, battles at your terms so you can't be really focused by other tanks. Otherwise, uh, basically your only armor is your uh, hit point pool, and that's basically it. And uh, if you haven't, if you want to know something more about the tank, please uh, check my uh, review on the Cheeto. It's a bit old uh, from the early days of my channel, uh, but it, there's also a video called the Gateway uh, to uh, Japanese line. Cheeto the gateway to your Japanese line or something like that. I can't really remember how I named it uh, But basically it's on the news. So uh, if you look at the news, you will find it. There is the last uh, news video uh, and uh, Yeah, I really like this tank and it's really really underestimated by the by the enemy teams mo in most games so basically that's your advantage because uh, when enemies see Cheeto, say, ah, it's a paper tank, I can uh, deal with it later. Only the big TDs like the SU-100Y uh, will probably focus you just because they can HE you easily. Uh, same as SU-152 and we are bottom tier in this game. And you're gonna see SU, so we are sitting on two kills already. It's uh, three against three and there's our little friend who was just sitting there. <laughs> <laughs> and trying to derp us out, so we, we, you need to buy bait shots uh, and that's basically uh, what you have to do and you, if you, you you shouldn't be able to uh, just get head on with the SU uh, so best thing uh, I could do here is just run from it and uh, just help my LTTB to clear this SP1C and uh, we'll be fine because it's gonna be 2 on 1 uh, and Thankfully uh, to this LTTB I was able to get my mastery so uh, yeah I have no idea I came to help him and he went to cap base God knows why because we're, losing, we're winning on uh, supremacy points as you can see uh, and we are losing uh, sorry winning on uh, tanks and that's the point where I got lucky so basically I got a shot there and thankfully SU and this derp gun, derp derp, mag derp, <laughs> missed me. And now we're gonna just uh, try to flank him out. Uh, we, we do a little maneuver here and uh, adrenaline is popping so we're gonna just simply clear him out. Before LTTDB got back here. So we got mastery as you can see, 3 kills. Uh, and 2010 damage, not much but 1036 base XP points was enough as you can see it was enough to get a mastery i wasn't expecting a mastery really but yeah if i got it yeah it's great so that's basically all for this episode uh i will make another video about upcoming new tanks uh probably today so wait for it take care bye bye consider subscribing and catch you all on the battlefield